What's up, YouTube fam? Brandon Weaver here once again, and thank you for letting me be a part of your life to help you repair your credit. I appreciate it. Thank you for being a part of the Subscribe Tribe, all right? First things first, we've got a great testimonial, a review, an individual closing on their dream house. This is phenomenal from what they've done here for themselves, what we've worked with with the Subscribe Tribe. This individual is getting their home, all right? Just wanted to say thank you for all the help and knowledge you've given me with the help of your removal letters and the general knowledge that you have given me on companies that give you high credit lines like the My Jewelers Club card and the New Coast Direct. To boost my credit score even higher along with a few other tactics that you have given me the chance to purchase a home that I will be closing on tomorrow. Thank you again. This is phenomenal. This is what I love about us being here, helping one another, me getting this information out to you guys, you guys go doing it, you guys can get it for yourself, 609creditpair.com, or we can do the work for you at theaustinlifegroup.com. We're getting excellent results for individuals. You may be one of them as well. So hit that subscribe button, hit the bell for notifications. I go live so you can talk to me directly so we can have a nice dialogue back and forth. And I'll tell you what, even if you can't get all your live time or your questions answered on time, you can email me. Please feel free to reach out. Email me, put in the comments below, subscribe tribe when you hit that subscribe button. Now, let's get into why you came here, the hard inquiries, right? Let's get it tight, Jerome, okay? Let's get it. No contract for the hard inquiry is no application for credit on file. Let's just get right into this one. Hello, Brandon. I've had an, uh, some hard inquiries removed, but I'm still working on some of them. Haven't got a response regarding some of my disputes, but I have received others that some of them have been quote unquote verified. However, this individual called the creditor and asked, did they have an application on file that stated that they applied for credit? The creditor, this bank, said no. And I asked for something in writing and they said there was nothing that they could send me. But it's up to me to dispute with the three bureaus. Reach out to them. Is there anything, I, any way or anything I can do to resolve this, they asked. They go on, okay? So, this person called the bank that they, and this is one of the tactics that we talk about. Aside from the letters that we have at 609creditpair.com that you can send directly to the creditor, directly to the credit bureaus, okay? Directly to these individuals to dispute these hard inquiries. I always say, find out if they have the original instrument of indebtedness, the signed contract. Find out if they have the original contract, the application for credit with your signature on it. Okay, I know what it looks like, I've seen it with my own two eyes. They've seen it, they know, but these people, said no, they don't have it. Why? They usually purge documents after 90 days. You're usually after about 90 days. Now, should they keep it? Probably. If they want to keep it on your credit for 24 months, they're saying two years. Well, shouldn't they keep that proof? How are they maintaining that documentation? I want to be able to see that. I want to be able to verify it. And then they can't verify it and they're not going to do anything about it. So yes, there are things that you can do to make them do so to potentially have them do so on their end. Of course, the complaints with the CFPB, you know, Take down that representative's information. I called such and such a bank on such and such a day. I talked to Mr. Smith about X, Y, and Z. They don't have an application for credit. I asked them. I have added, disputed with the bureaus. You can tell the bureaus this. You can send that with your letter to the bureaus and you can let them know. You are not verifying with the creditor because I have verified with the creditor and you guys are falsifying or violating my rights. It's that simple. And the bureaus don't want to be taken to court. We've had another customer out there. If you're watching the live streams, if you're watching the videos, you know Garrett out there. He talked directly to the bureaus. He told them, hey, I can take you to court. $1,000 per unverified inquiry. They very quickly backed up, deleted this. They will do stuff as far as you allow them to get away with violating your rights under the Fair Credit Reporting Act. And all of these are available to you, 609creditrepair.com. We've got letters for you on hard inquiries. You get that Beyond Committed package. We have helped people at theawesomelifegroup.com with their hard inquiry removals, okay? So do not hesitate. Credit Repair starts now. When does it start? It starts now. In the comments below, put Credit Repair Starts Now and let me know if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. Feel free to email me if this video helps you out. Please give a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, that bell for notifications for when I go live. And until I see you in person, I will see you on the other side. Take care.